In this video, I'm going to show you a game-changing Spotify feature that will change the way you control and listen to the music in your birthday parties and any other group event. Spotify has an amazing feature called Group Session and the Group Session feature lets you listen and control the music in real time with your friends and family. Now if you're someone who's interested in this, then make sure you watch the video till the end. Before you start using the group session, you need to know these three key points. First one, group session is only available for mobile and tablet applications. Uh, second, uh, it's only available for premium users. And third, you can only add up to five users per session. That being said, let's dive into my iPhone and let me show you how to use the group session on Spotify. Now, in order to use group session on your phone, simply open Spotify and play any song. Now you can see that, that the song is minimized now. Simply click on uh, the minimized window. Now you can see that the song has maximized and you can see on the top, on the bottom left corner, there is an icon for multi-device uh, setup. Simply click on the multi-device icon and you will see there is an option to start a group remote session. Simply click on start a remote group session and it will give you an option to invite your friends. Click on invite friends and you can see that there are so many different options that you can use to invite your friends. Once you've invited your friends uh, and they've joined the session, you can see the list of your friends here. And I can see here that you can invite up to seven friends. Uh, I said earlier that you can invite up to five friends, but it looks like Spotify has increased the number of people. So I do apologize for the information that I gave uh, before. Now, once your friend see your invite, they will see a screen like this. And they'll once they click on join session, uh, they'll see another screen that looks like this. Now it gives them two option. First one is join same device as the host. And the second one is on my own device. So if, the, if they select the first option, they can control the music, but the music will still play from the speaker that is, that is connected to the host's machine. And this sort of feature is useful for when you're in a party, you, you wanna listen to the music from the same speaker but still uh, able to change the music. And if you use the second option on my device, then when you change the music, you can listen to your, listen to your music on your own device and whoever has joined the session, they can listen to the music all, on all their devices at the same time. This sort of feature is useful when you're all at a remote location, but you still want to listen to the same playlist. How amazing is that? That's all I got for you in today's video. If you love the video, make sure you share the video and subscribe the channel for more amazing videos like this. I appreciate you and I hope you have an amazing day.